house fire. Bad one. At least four Vicks. Get out there and find out what you can. The address is 650 North Hobart. All right. Well, someone has a real fetish for uh, origami. I just don't know how to dance to bebop. All right. Well, I never asked you, so I don't know why you just said that to me. But anyway, welcome back to LA Noir. Uh, I don't know how many more cases we have left, but we should be closing in on the end of the game. And is this LA Noir or uh, wait, where are we going? Or heavy rain? Because that dude, he he loved his origami. That's for sure. Anyway, more house fires because we got the murdered. Remember, I can't remember your name. I actually haven't played this game in a very long time. I can't remember his name. You hear about Rancho Escondido? Are we having a conversation, Biggs? Biggs. Okay, fuck it. Get on. I'm teasing you, Herschel. 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 Tell me about right. it. The new housing development's a couple of weeks from completion. Burned to the ground last night. GIs are ready to move in this weekend. The developers gonna have some very angry customers. We're having a, a recurring theme of this uh, suburban redevelopment font, huh? Huh. This is kind of like the insta heat of uh, house this. fires. I hope you have strong stomachs. Actually, no, because it. Oh, uh oh. We're gonna look at some crispy bodies in here. Oh my god. Do you have a name? Morelli, Mike. We recovered a picture of the family. Anything else? To be honest, I just got here, Phelps. Best you talk to Lynch. He's the expert. It doesn't make any sense. Why aren't they scattered around like the rest of the debris? I think they've been moved. Ooh. I think someone moved them after the explosion and before the fire. Can you explain that, please? I'm almost positive the cause of death is asphyxiation due to gas inhalation. Look at the parts of their bodies that aren't scorched. The coloring around the fingertips is typical. It wouldn't have felt a thing. I think the fire of damage is post-mortem. I think someone moved him into this room after the explosion. It still doesn't make any sense. Why would you run into a burning building? That is fucked up. What the hell? Look how, like, they just kneed like that. Kneeled like that. What are you doing? The prayer effect is from the fire. The muscles and tendons contract. That's so fucked up. Oh my god. Alright. What other clues do we have in here? Let's get out of this room. What's this? Oh, it's the picture of the family. Another day. You ever think about how many people have died in this world? And how big heaven would have to be to accommodate them, Biggs? No, I have not. Show some respect. <laughs> Biggs. It's our boy. I think he watches the fires. I think the Sawyer fire went wrong. So what about the guy we have in jail, Phelps? We got the wrong guy. That doesn't explain why he ran into a burning building. What would make anyone do that? Guilt. For the fires? For his mistake. This guy wants to burn houses, not families. He expects the houses to be empty. He was trying to redeem himself. Probably thought they'd be happier together. You are one very disturbed individual, Phelps. I know you had it rough lately, but you should start to compartmentalize your thoughts. You could be right. Can you come up with an alternative explanation? I'm sure, it's the same guy. Are you telling me that some son of a bitch murdered these people, the whole family, and arranged them here like Cupid dolls? It might fit, Cole, but I don't think we could ever prove it. There's very little evidence. Evidence! Albert, check out the hot water system. Make sure we're dealing with the same MO. Sure, Phil. So and he's about to throw off. the rest of us, Cole. You better find out what's eating pigs. Yeah, wait, is that him? No, I don't even know where he went. He's gone. That was, uh... My goodness. Let's get the fuck out of here. I've had enough of this place.
So something finally got to you. You want my help, pretty boy? You got it. You keep riding me and you won't be pretty much longer. We can get this guy, Herschel. You think you've seen everything, Phelps? I was with the 2nd Marines at Bella Wood. Things that went on in that farmhouse. My own guys, on fire, screaming for a way out. You're not gonna get this guy. There's gonna be no photos and no citations. We're gonna kill this miserable fuck. End of story. You get this? You remember the list from the travel agent? Sure. The Morellis were winners, too. Their name was on that list. Christ. We should take a look around, work the neighbors, see what they know. I'll go across the street. Okay, I'll try this side. I haven't done this for years. Man, Herschel wants a murder, huh? Oh, isn't that convenient? Hello, sir. Conveniently walking out. LAPD, can you tell me anything about the fire next door? Terrible luck. Imagine after having won that weekend away. What's your name, sir? Foreman. Dudley Foreman. Dudley Foreman. Did you see or hear anything that might have... Look, we were asleep when we heard the explosion. What? Statement from the neighbor indicating Morelli family had... Um, I'm going to doubt that. You didn't like Morelli, did you? Some neighbors you get along with, some you don't. Guess they should have sold up. What do you mean? They're knocking down all these old houses and building a new subdivision for GIs. Morelli was being difficult. You said someone is knocking these houses down? Elysian Fields. You must know them. They're billboards. That Monroe character beaming down at you. We've had an offer for the house. Did the Morellis want to sell? I don't know. Uh, fuck. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, God damn it. You know that everyone else had sold up, but you didn't know about your next door neighbor? Like I said, we had some history. Why is cheese, honestly? You said the Morellis had won a weekend away to Catalina Island? Yeah, that's right. First thing I thought after the explosion was, thank goodness they was away. But then I find out they were still in there. Who was running the competition? What? I don't know. No, I gotta doubt that. Straight up. Now he's got a poker face, but that that was so unconvincing. What? I don't know. All right, I'll I need go more, fuck Mr. myself. Foreman. Tell me what you know about the I'll suburban redevelopment myself. fund. I know nothing about it. I've never heard of them. <sighs> fuck you! All right, let's go. I'm sorry I suck, man. Oh, can we talk to these guys? No? Alright, well. Let's see if he's got any luck, because I can't fucking interrogate for shit. What do we have? Advice? Need more from the neighbors, Cole. Keep working. Need more from the neighbors. Are there more neighbors? Who else can we speak to? Oh, there's... There's clues around here. Hold up. Maybe we should have checked the clues before speaking to the guy. That might have helped. What? There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. There's music. Oh, here we go. Oh, we're checking shoe size, huh? Or not, never mind. What's this? Nothing? What?
Alright, well, there's something around here somewhere. A clue of some sorts. Maybe the mailbox? No. What the fuck, man? There's gotta be something here somewhere. There is music going on. Oh, hold up. Oh, the footprints! What the hell? I didn't even see him. Whoever he was, he was wearing boondockers. I would know that imprint anywhere. Okay. And cigarettes, I don't think that's useful. Oh, maybe they are. Someone was keeping watch. Looks like they were here for quite a while. Ran looks distinctive. Yeah, that's a lot of cigarettes, damn. What, more clues? Do I have to speak to this guy again? Here we go. Did you see anyone hanging around the Morelli's home prior to the explosion? Nope. Can't say as I was looking out, though. Well, there's a guy standing outside your house. I think you're covering for someone, Foreman. Who is it? And I think you are off your rocker. How can you make an accusation like that? What proof have you got? Could I say, uh, that stuff? I don't know, he might not know. I made a mistake. I'll just doubt it. Fuck it. You sure, Mr. Oh, yeah, I got one right. There are signs of someone hanging around over there by the fence. Hey, now that you come to think of it, there was a guy. Kind of tall. Skinny, though. Anything else? Orange lumber jacket, beat up hat, and no hair. I thought he was the pest exterminator guy who was working around here the last few days. But that guy had hair. Thanks for your time, Mr. Foreman. Sure. Hey, if you're interested, I have one of those competition flyers in the kitchen. I could get it for you if you like. That would be great. Any luck, Cole? A couple of things. What did you pick up? A folded piece of paper. It looks complicated. Japanese call it origami. Can I take a look? Sure. Oh my god, it is an origami puzzle. Paper crane. There's a legend about them. You fold 1,000 of these and you get a wish. So this guy's superstitious or some hey, shit. Don't break it. Don't worry, there's Not more where that came from. It. it looks like a waybill or a flyer. A Building lot. a better California. We want to buy your old home Great today. Elysian Fields developments. Elysian Fields. Interesting. Oh, I see you already have one. Except that bottom bit. When did the flyer arrive in your mailbox? Not there. They've been arriving for weeks. This one was in the mailbox when I got home from work yesterday afternoon. Can we uh, check it out a little more? Oh well, no. All right. Look at his face over there. Okay. Let's uh, let's have a word with how can I help detective. Oh wait, are there more clues? What? Are there more clues? Where are there more clues? Maybe. Let me let me speak to the phone. <laughs> let me speak to the phone first. Is somebody gonna tell us what the hell is going on? Because I heard music. Oh! Fucking control on my skull. I need an address for a property developer. Elysian Fields Developments. One moment, detective. The address is 748 North Oxford Avenue, Wilshire. Anything else? Messages, please. If you have a message, contact Captain McKelty immediately. Thanks. Can you put me through, operator? Of course. Here you are. We'll need to check that. Commander? Leads on the Morelli farm. We're about to go and visit Elysian Fields Developments. You're about to do what? Leland Monroe? He's a personal friend of the mayor and the chief. Are you out of your mind? I'm warning you, Phelps. Commander, we have a line of inquiry. You have something you bring it to me. You're hanging by a 
thread, Phelps. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Good. Have a report on my desk today. Jeez. has warned us off over a loop. Makes sense. It's a dead end. We should check out Rancho Escondido. You know the place. Well, Why can I still hear clues over here? What is going on? Is there something else over here somewhere? That I'm not seeing? Oh, hang on. Oh, there's a newspaper. Here we go. Is this one of the flashback newspapers? Oh, it is. Story time. Housing development burns ex-serviceman rate has uh, GI houses raised. Oh, shit. How did you get my number, Ira? At first, I didn't understand you. But now I do. I'd like you to come back to the clinic. I'm helping other people now, doctor. I think you are confused. You haven't been to the clinic for weeks. I'm not confused anymore, doctor. I'm helping people be together. This world is only temporary. We'll all be happier in heaven. Why don't you tell me where you are and I can come to you? I think the fire should end now. They have served their purpose. Oh, the fires are only beginning, doctor. After the fires, everything will be beautiful and clean. Everything will be erased. The world will be fresh and new. I can see my purpose now, Doctor. And you helped me to find it. Bro, this doctor, man. This doctor. Alright, what else do we have over here? Anything? Oh wait, is that a clue? That is a clue. But the music's off. Oh, it's like still a clue model. anyway. Reginald... Oh, it's Bali! Oh, that guy. Is that everything? I think that might be everything. I think we're good. I think we can get out of here. All right. You're behind the wheel. Well, we can't go to Elysian Fields, can we? Fuck it, we're going there anyway. Shame about Jeff. The arson desk has been trying to nail that son of a bitch for years. He's still in custody, Herschel. Want to bet? They'll have kicked the moose already. Can't hold him for misdemeanor cigarettes and matches. 